first one that I'm going to unbox is I got this new P400 short throw mini projector from AXA. I think that's how they're pronounced. I, in my last room, I got a projector already. It was much bigger than this one. The quality was not there, so I returned it pretty quickly. And then the leak happened, so I moved into this. And now I don't really have a giant wall to use. But we have been planning to get another projector soon anyway. So I'm going to decide whether we put this permanently in the bedroom or if we're going to make space and buy a screen in our living room. I think that would be really fun. This is what we're working with. I'll show you, you've got some controls. It looks like it might be touch because there's no physical button at all. PF card, not sure what that is. This is where your projection comes out of. And 1080. I know you guys could probably say, oh, just get 4K, but my last one that I got was 4K and it was not. It was not great quality. Plus like a lot of the shows I watch are like 720. I watch a lot of older shows and I don't watch a lot of stuff in 4K. Okay, so it comes with this little tripod, very lightweight, pretty standard. We've got the remote not sure oh, okay so these are your controls for I guess like the type of angle the connection so we'll play with that later I don't know where I can put this in my room to test it out I have a little sliver of a wall that way but it's daylight so obviously we're gonna get to that portion later tonight to test out oh I didn't even show this side of course a, a cube has four sides so we've got your HDMI input not sure what this scrolly thing is we'll check once it's on you've got an on and off button here if you want to put headphones in just plugged it in and a red light has come up from the front. I might have to come back to this later. So here's me setting it up. I want to preface that I couldn't figure out how to make it smaller because it literally filled my entire room. I know the largest size goes up to 100 inches, but it was bleeding into my pillows. So maybe in another video, I'll have it figured out by then. So this thing is really, really cool, but don't expect the quality to be this incredible 4K type deal because of the price. For its price point though, I will say I think it's great and it would make an awesome Christmas present because gaming on this is just chef's kiss. It just feels so immersive, it's awesome. I've gotta say, right out of the box, the focus of this is so great and so on point. Like I've spent so much more money on another projector before and all of the corners were so blurry that I couldn't even play games with the UI like The Sims because I just couldn't see anything. But this really is like an out of the box plug and play everything's just ready to go out of the box it's a little washed out but you'll see what a difference it makes to just play around with the saturation and brightness settings after plugging it into my computer instead i noticed certain things that had too much contrast just wouldn't show up at all so keep that in mind again don't expect this thing to look like a hologram but i'd say that this is definitely more for casual use like movies and gaming you might have seen this trend go viral a couple years ago it was so vibey i highly recommend doing it just for this reason it looks so good it's so cozy it's so calming so i loved it for this thank you so much axa for sending me the p400 short throw projector i love it it's so fun and I'm gonna have a ton of fun gaming on this. Just wanna give